What Prophet Uber Angel said about Bill Gates have been overlooked, but it will blow your mind. I might have shot a video like this. I am here to shoot. You can name it part two. All Christians have to notice these things because it will help us as Christians. This is what Prophet Uber Angel said about Bill Gates. Let's go watch this one. Bill Gates. <laughs> In all these states you see on the screen, oh, yes. he now owns the biggest farmland acreage, the biggest acreage of farmland in America. Mm. Mm. Not only that, he now he bought the company that controls the seeds. Mm. My God. Mm. Of almost everything you know mm. to be an agricultural plant. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. Why would you control seeds? Mm. Ah. Mm. What do you want that for? Mm. Ah. What's the objective of it? It's a seed bank he controls now. Mm. My God. Mm. One person. Mm. Wow. Why seed in particular? Because mm. all these companies, what they are doing now is to buy land. Yes. Because mm. if you buy land, you control the people. Oh, yes. Mm. If you buy land, you control the food. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. Mm. Wow. Wow. Mm. Mm. <laughs> what, did, what did Warren Buffett say when he was the richest man at that time? Uh -huh. mm. He said, I don't want to buy gold. Mm. He said, imagine aliens on another planet mm. looking at guards with guns. And alien says, why are they there? Mm -hmm. So they are getting something is shiny. Mm. Mm. And they open the door and see a shiny object. They go like, okay, does it give birth? No, it doesn't. No. Does it increase after two hours? No, it doesn't. <laughs> so that's the most stupid thing you can buy. Mm. Mm. That's what he said. Wow. <laughs> but then he turned around and bought a company that does gold. Wow. Oh my God. Mm. And yet increasing in agriculture as well. Because mm. mm. she was an agriculture man. Oh, mm. yes. Mm. And furniture and all that and all that. Mm. Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, mm. Berkshire Hathaway is the company that has got the shares that cost more than anything. Mm -hmm. Mm. You're talking about thousands here. Mm -hmm. oh, my God. And belongs to Warren Buffett. Mm. But he's in farming as well. Mm. Look at the rich people. They are going into farming. Mm. Yes. They know what it is. Yes. What, what do you think? We are here in Zimbabwe here where the government did land redistribution. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What happened? The white community went crazy, mm. went bizarre, they, go, went, they went yes. mad. Oh, yes. Yes. We didn't know land was special, yes. mm. family, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. until the white people got angry. Yes. Mm. Yeah. And then all of a sudden realized, why are they getting so angry? Yeah. And you move into towns, mm. even in uh, Southern Africa here, yes. even in Africa, yes. you won't see white people shopping with you. Mm. Mm. Never. Never. They are staying at the farms. Yes. Yes. They are always there. Yeah. <laughs> Mm. They are always there. That's a statement of, mm. of uh, yeah. Okay. Do you understand? They are always what? The mm -hmm. farms. The, the, the farms. farms. Yes. Mm. They come to town with shorts, mm -hmm. mm. slip-ons, yes. all these farming mm. shoes. Mm. Mm. And that's it. They go to their farms. Mm -hmm. And they build hotels for you mm. <laughs> to go and book with your wife, with your girlfriend. Mm. <laughs> your side chick and stay in the farm. Yeah. Yeah. And while it's there at the farm. Yes. <laughs> because they know who should spend money, you mm. fools. Uh -huh. They know they, they definitely know we are fools that will do it. Mm. Yes. Mm. My God. So you like the technology that they bring, they don't live there. Yeah. They are in the farms. Mm. Mm. Yes. Then once in a while go on holiday, mm -hmm. they come back to their farms. Yes. But we grew up in this debt, mm. and we were doing what? Farming. Yes. Subsistence farming, nonetheless. Yes. Yes. You know, it wasn't commercial. Mm -hmm. So we had commercial farming. Mm. Mm. But what God is telling you is simple. Go into farmland. Oh, yes. Buy mm. farms for yourself. Mm. Mm. Learn to do it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Powerful. I went to China there, and they're selling this machine that can... Condense, I don't know what they what it does. Mm -hmm. Air will get water from the air, mm. five gallons a day. Mm. Just a machine. Mm. Start it and it collects whatever air and mm. compresses it, whatever the science is, and, and turns into water. Mm -hmm. No mm -hmm. need for borrowers anymore. Wow. My God. Wow. Just hear me well. Just take him from wow. Right now, the record number mm. of celebrities mm. building bangers, mm -hmm. underground bangers. The cash here is what these elites are doing what they are doing with lands 
what is the purpose of having lands what is so because of the importance of land what will you do with the land it wouldn't just lay bare or the land wouldn't just be there without using it for anything definitely will be planting what did the guy did he he's having a seed company now he's not a christian people in europe and america even africans import from america and some parts of europe what will happen to us when you ask an african man to farm he will think that's a poor man's way of doing things but you see these people they occupy the lands they farm on the lands they produce they distribute how about we christians though how about we what are we doing with our lands and then you see the simple explanation not explanation comment that prophet by angel copied from warren buffett he said gold is just stagnant and how rare it is that's why it has price on the market but come to think of it warren buffett is not really saying gold is not important what he's saying is that invest into things that has to do with production more demand and supply more somebody will say there is production with gold i know i'm a finance person i already understand we produce we use gold for jewelries we use gold for this and that and that i understand but go into farming because you farm you produce you distribute a whole lot of things happen these people are owning lands very soon they will own lands in africa very soon they will come here chinese have occupied ghana mining on our lands because our kings and our our people have given them the chance to destroy And so, what Prophet is saying is that this is not a bad thing, in my opinion. It's not a bad thing. It's what we have to see and learn. Prophet is a finance person. He's very typical in finance. And so, he knows these things are good things you should, you should do. So, even his, in his previous broadcast, for some time now, he's been like, fam, do this, do that. Get lands. Go to the king in your community. Go and ask him, give me lands. I want to farm. What are you doing? All right, what are you doing as a Christian? I was just sitting there. I posted something on my status and I was like, in Ga not in Ghana, just in Ghana, but our Christian council need to build a consolidated fund whereby we use that fund to open businesses, lucrative businesses, to create employment for Christians. Most of our people are not even employed. The whole myth in Ghana. If the Christian Council, all of these churches come together, they dedicate some funds. They say, okay, this fund should be consolidated. We are going to use this fund to build businesses to employ Christians. Nobody's talking about this because everybody wants to be selfish with church money. That's the bit. That's where I'll end. That's just a digression. But the main thing is, what Prophet by Angel is saying about what Bill Gates is doing, what Warren Buffett is doing, is something we must learn to do as Christians. One day, when this pandemic came in, how many of the churches, some churches did that, but how many of the churches called you and say, oh, uh, the offering we collected from this day to that day. We are supporting everybody. How many? I'm a Christian. That doesn't unmake me a Christian. Doesn't, doesn't, doesn't have to say, oh, this and that. I'm just trying to say we should be deep with our thoughts now. This time around, something must change. We have to be Christians with class. You get what I mean? This is what worldly people are doing. What are we doing? My name is Chodanish. I love to break down gospel messages like this. Make sure you subscribe, share, like this video. I'm out.